On the night of June 21st, 1942, Fort Stevens saw its only action when a Japanese sub fired five and a half inch shells in the vicinity of the fort. The shelling caused no damage and the commander at the time refused to retaliate. This incident made Fort Stevens the first continental U.S. installation to be attacked since the War of 1812. I'm George Vassar, United States Coast Guard, Chief Petty Officer, and you're watching P Exposed. Now this is the kind of interview that I like to do. We're with Ken Wilson down here in the Cabernet Room of the Hotel Elliott. Tell us about the Cabernet Room and tell us about what we're about to do. What we do down here is we sample wine. Uh, we do periodic wine tastings from various Northwest wines. Uh, we try and feature Northwest wines here. What we've got with us here now is a Cabernet from uh, Washington State, Dunham Cellars. Very good cab. Cheers. So tell us about this room. There's a, there's a movie theme. You've got a cigar room down here. Uh, people go in and have a good cigar, enjoy a glass of wine, relax. Very popular. Surprisingly popular with the women, which surprised me. Talk about the renovation. The renovation took two and a half years. It started in 2000, um, toward the end of 2000, and it reopened on April Fool's Day, 2003. Went from 68 rooms to 32. With the 68 rooms, there were two bathrooms on each floor. Uh, modern convenience, we do have a bathroom now in each unit with heated floors. That's what I wanted you to talk about, because that's unique to this hotel. Oh, yeah. Yeah, all the bathrooms have heated floors. Our club suites have the two-person jacuzzi spa tubs. The heated floors impress me. I mean, what, what other things are unique? Because this is really a unique property here. It is a unique property. We uh, do deliver a light breakfast basket to every room every morning. Uh, we have our rooftop garden, which is a beautiful spot. We have 360-degree views of all over Astoria and Columbia River. Several nice places to go in the evening, uh, down on the river or around here, right across the street from us. The schooner is a great place to hang out, great food, great And fun. they also deliver your room service. They do room service for us. They nice. deliver right yeah. down here to the bar. They have a nice little appetizer menu here with some great uh, crab and fondue and other entries there that are really good. Because I'm kind of thinking here with the wine, and it's, you know, it's that time of day where maybe a little room service might Perfect. be a good call. And I'll tell you what, if I, if I bring a special lady to the Hotel Elliott, I'm probably not going to want to leave the room. Crab cakes. Thanks for housing us. Thanks for coming. We look forward to having you. Over 15 Hollywood blockbusters have been filmed here in the Astoria area, including Kindergarten Cop, Short Circuit, Free Willy, most recently The Ring 2, and filmed right here in this house behind me, cult classic The Goonies. Come see the new additions at the Schooner Restaurant. You're watching PD Exposed. Ah! Well, Shell talks to Chris the chef. I've been sent on the most important job, and that's ordering drinks for the crew. So, Mark and Brent back here are going to work their magic, and I'm going to bring drinks to the crew. You brought us six entrees. We had the wild salmon uh, seared with a uh, balsamic honey sauce, and then it came on some haystack sweet potatoes and wilted spinach. We had a seafood trio pasta that came with a penne pasta. Uh, warm water lobster tail with the saffron cream sauce. Roasted half chicken, which is a new addition to our menu here. Cooking for him is obviously an art. Everything came out so well prepared. What is it that excites you about cooking? Just the, the freedom to, to create whatever I feel like doing. Um, living here, it's a great area. We have the best fish in the world. We have, you know, wild mushrooms this time of year, and it's just 
the great fresh ingredients that I can get here. Thank you so much for having us tonight at the schooner. It's been my pleasure. Lewis and Clark camped near Astoria in the winter of 1805 and 1806, establishing Fort Clatsop, the first U.S. military post west of the Rockies. Let's make some fire. It's kind of cold. That's how they did it. 